Bennett, the robust and dark figure adorned with royal clothes, mounted on a gigantic turtle, holding in his white arms a tray overflowing with seafood, escorted by a beautiful mermaid and an elegant page, the strong personality of Don Armando R.C. Gordillo, El Mamucas. The image is the emblematic logo of his famous restaurant in the beautiful Mastlin, and highlights the time, in which he was proclaimed King of Carnival, in the mid-80s of the last century. Founded in 1961, by El Mamucas, the restaurant first operated in a palapa, on Cinco de Mayo Street, almost on the corner of 16 de Septembre, offering cold seafood and hot seafood. Upon entering the beautiful port, the first thing you noticed was the breadth and cleanliness of the incredible boardwalk, which the locals say is the largest in the world. In this case, as in so many stories about Mastlin, it is better to believe than to find out. Knowing the restaurant, El Mamucas, and its owner, was not only a priority when arriving in Mastlin, but also an obligation to savor the culinary delights and seafood, which already exceeded many borders. Everyone called Don Armando El Mamucas. The smells of the food being prepared were extremely alluring. The kitchen was practically next to the entrance door, and those smells were mixed to motivate the palate, and give any diner training an intention of being a gourmet. In his magical hands, Don Armando's culinary powers were transformed. He highlights above all that of inventiveness, originality, and creation. In his prodigious hands, dishes were born that today go around the world, and are prepared for the enjoyment of the finest and most educated palates, and prepared by the most professional chefs. From his magical space came works such as Sharks 2, Grouper Meatballs, Mamyukun Shrimp, Chamuko Oysters, Marlin, and Shrimp Machakas, as well as countless delicacies from the ocean, which in his magical hands were transformed into original dishes. The walls of its spacious as a simple space, were decorated with proud photographs of hugs to Don Armando, by international and national artists. Such as Gregory Peck, Steve McQueen, Ken Tinflis, Lola Beltran, Perez Prado and Maria Felix, who liked when they were in Mastlin, to eat the delights of El Mamucas. Associated with the best comedians of the time, the unforgettable Polyvoses, the visit of Raul Velasco and Juan Gabriel, Don Armando transferred his gastronomic inventiveness to the capital of our country, and although the experience was brief, he also left his seal of quality and enormous prestige there. The legacy of Don Armando R.C. Gordillo, is palpable, and better yet, edible. Practically, all the menus of the tasty Marismina food, have been tasted by many foreign and national tourists. Don Armando passed away in 1996, but his daughter, Elsie, continued the tradition in a place rented on Simon Bolivar Street. On January 24, 2015, the restaurant closed due to lack of clientele and the economic crisis. Much later, other seafood centers arose, which invariably offered many of the dishes created by El Mamukas on their menus.